Hey YouTube, it's Aiden here. Um, I know I haven't made a video in a little while, so I can't really get the means to do it on my computer, so I'm just doing it through my phone. Um, so I am, I think I'm eight weeks post-op today. Um, for some reason it's not the 19th of the second month, um, but obviously there's not exactly four months in each month. So, four weeks in each month. So, um, just figured I'd show with the shirt on, obviously. I mean, there's nothing really there. Um, I'll take the shirt off, and you guys can see the scar treatment I've been using. Okay. So this is my chest with the scar treatment on. Um, I just got back to the gym, so I'm a little pumped up. Uh, so this is my chest with the scar treatment on. Um, looks really good, you know. I really like it. Um, I like these. <laughs> Better than Scar Guard. They stay on well if you put them on when they're wet. It's actually called, I don't have it up here. It's called like Scar Away. Um, it's like $20 for almost eight weeks um, worth of treatment. You put these on for a week. Uh, you wash them before you get in the shower. And then I put them on when they're still wet. They seem to stick really well if you put them on wet. Um, and you like wash them just with like water in your fingers. Kind of massage them in. Um, I've been using these. The only thing is I have noticed when I take them off, they kind of hurt a little bit. Like, they kind of pull at my scar. But, um, like I said, I just, I feel like these, I definitely feel like they, my scars went down a little bit, the bump in them. But, uh, yeah, so, my nipples are looking really well. I'm trying to move you without making me sick. My nipples are looking really, really well. Um, this right one actually was the one that was ahead of the game. And now it actually fell behind, which is pretty interesting. Um, so now it's it caught back up with my left one. So my left one was behind, and then my right one was behind. There's still a little peeling going on. Um, but otherwise, they're really good. I try not to touch them. So I'll take this off. You just kind of peel it off. Um, and then you wash it with cold water. I'll wash it in a minute. But... Like I said, they stick a little bit. They don't hurt a lot, but uh, they hurt a little bit, especially in the beginning when I first started taking them off. They hurt a little bit. But I wear them overnight and everything like that. Um, I had accidentally hit my nipple, and uh, I got a little bit of bleeding. So I put a big bandage on, and I actually have, still have a cut right here because the skin is so delicate. It just ripped the skin right off. It's pretty crazy. Um... So, just an update on the scars. They definitely stretched. Um, I mean, it's I'm not I'm not talking um, a little dramatic. That wasn't as painful as it looked. Uh, <laughs> they've definitely stretched a little bit. Um, you could probably tell from my previous videos that they've stretched. Um, but it's kind of you know I'm back at the gym and I can't like stay away from the gym. And I've kind of just, um, kind of just accepted that I'm going to have scars. And I'm so young in the game that I just keep saying, like, the redness, I'm going to work on the redness and try to get it down. Get it down. Um, with these things, it's really cool because I don't really have to put sunscreen on because that and a shirt and it's turning into winter. Um, but I'll get a little close up. You can definitely tell that they've, sh sorry. They've stretched a little bit. I mean, they're honestly, they still look pretty good. I've seen guys with a lot more stretch scars. Um, this is my left. And then this is my right. So, I mean, I've definitely seen worse. But, I, you know, I think I was just so fixated on not having any scars that I forgot that I will have scars. Um... My mom's a nurse, I was talking to her, and I was showing her some of the little scars I have. And she said, um, you know, after a year, you gotta at least give it a year. At least a year, um, to see the pigmentation go down. Um, again, you know, it's gonna be winter soon, there's not gonna be as much sun. I have been putting sunscreen on when I was using ScarGuard. Now I'm using these guys. Um, I was doing some research online, and like, I think those are like 20 SPF, and then a shirt on top would be another 10, so... Um, I just feel like when I put these on, I can't put sunscreen over them because what is that doing? Nothing. Um, unless you guys know of, of something different. So, otherwise, this is what it looks like now. I think it looks freaking awesome. Um, I can, like, make a muscle now. 
you know, without a problem, without it hurting. Um, they're a little, like, above the skin, but not here. Here's real flat, only right here. And I think that's because that's where the tubes ended, and even when he, uh, Dr. Garamoni pulled out my uh, drains, like, these were big, like, they were really raised, and he said that'll go down. So, otherwise, I think it looks fairly well. Uh, my range of motion, I can do this, I can do this, but I try not to go higher than that. Uh, even when I'm working out, I, I don't do anything above anything. Um, I do a lot of seated like this and, you know, everything else besides going up. Even when I go out, I don't really go higher than that. I probably could, but I'm trying, you know, since I am working, I'm trying not to push too, too hard. Um, yeah, so I think it looks pretty good. I'm getting some hair. You can't see it on here, but I'm getting, I have a little bit of hair here, but I'm getting some hair actually right along the scar lines, which is cool too. I figure with some fading and with the hair, that'd be awesome. Um, the nipple placement looks great. They look the same size. Um, yeah, I'm really happy with it. I really am. It's an amazing feeling to uh, to just put on a shirt at the gym. I can see what I'm working on. I can actually see my muscles now. It's great. It's awesome. Um, and I just, you know, I keep saying too, like, first of all, I can't go out like this anyway, because of the sun and everything, it's not good for my scars right now, the pigmentation of it, so I really get to wear flat tank tops and stuff like that to the gym, and that's awesome, um, and I'm just focusing on that right now, uh, yeah, so it's exciting, uh, looks, looks good, I'm happy about it. One thing I have noticed, though, oddly enough, the lighting keeps changing, that's weird, oddly enough, I have noticed that, um, now I've noticed my acne more um, on my chest and my shoulders. It went down a lot on my back. I don't know if you can see my back there, but it went down a lot on my back um, because of uh, because I'm not wearing the binder anymore. But if you look at my shoulders, they're pretty bad, actually. They, this camera makes them look good, but they're pretty bad. Um, but I have some old, old, old proactive I've been using. So I've been using that, and uh, it's only been about four days, and I feel I really feel like they're diminishing smaller and smaller. So I'll keep that up, and doing it twice a day. Um, yeah, so this is my chest. Rawr. Sorry I've been making updates. I've been uh, moving, so my life is a little hectic right now, but um, as it calms down, it'll be good and better. Um, yeah, so I think it looks good. Really happy with it. Okay, guys. I gotta get my stinky ass into the shower. I will talk to you guys later. And, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching everything. Alright. Peace.